You get a hat, and you get a hat. What's up, guys? Jibber Shake just here today, and today we're gonna be looking at some theories about the next Hearthstone expansion. We already did some top five themes, which were really fun, and we also did cards that we thought would go into the Hall of Fame. But this is based strictly on what we've seen from the latest Hearthstone teaser. So this, what we got here, is we got a Lunara, Medivh, and what I assume is Morgul, all uh, turn into stone. So, and then there's like this swirling mass around them, and it's like they look like they're in a big cave, floating island, floating objects. Really, really weird and like eerie in a way. So what we're going to do is we're going to go through some theories I think that it could be, and some theories I think it is not. Um, most of this is going to be theories I think it could be though. So, let's get into it. So starting number, we're going to start with the ones that I think aren't true. And that's going to start with the Maelstorm. Now I know a lot of people, I've seen some comments saying that they think that this is going to be the Maelstorm maybe. I don't think that's true, partly because it's too dark and I don't see enough water swirling. And in fact, you don't really see any water. So that's just a really quick one. I kind of just wanted to get that out of the way. Maelstrom is not going to be it mainly, so don't count on that. I would be very surprised if it was. Second theory I'm going to debunk is Hagatha. Uh, some people said that you know it's very shamanistic, and you know the quote that it said was "a storm is coming," which is a very shaman line uh, from Warcraft Three, if you don't know. But I didn't want to do. I don't think that it's Hagatha Theater. They already spent Hagatha in Witchwood in the Year of the Raven, and then Hagatha in the League of Evil. I think they're ready to move on to a new villain, and I don't think Hagatha, of all the League of Member members, is a person that we want to focus on that much. So I'm gonna say no to Hagatha. Although, if we hadn't had this, I wouldn't like debunk it as much because. Like, it is a very shamanistic place. We see a lot of lightning, a lot of shaman vibes going on here. So those are the two theories I'm going to debunk. Uh, I don't think they are really going to happen at all. I would be shocked if they did. So now let's get into the theories I think it could be. So starting with theory number one. You guys ready for theory number one? All right, here it is. Naga. So, in case y'all don't know. Naga are awesome, and they have never really had a true expansion. We've had the Naga Witches, which were like 5 cost 5 fives doing some cool stuff. But this is the first time we could actually get that. My theory is maybe they'll do something like invent a new character. Rafam is technically a character never from Warcraft. He was created just for Hearthstone. And he's become a beloved character. So I don't think it's too unreasonable to believe they would do that again. And Nagas have never really had their fair share, and I think it would be kind of cool. So, when looking at this, we got cards like Zola, if you guys don't remember from Kobolds and Catacombs, but Zola was one of the, uh, she was a very popular uh, legendary in the Kobolds and Catacomb era, and she was like a Naga Sea Witch. And then we also have cards like Lady Vosh and other, you know, really cool, just really neat heroes that could make a really cool impact on the game. So, my theory is maybe they, she turned some of Harsh Warcraft's best heroes into, sto into statues and maybe the, we have to go with some like other famous explorer or something like that to go save them and turn them back into, you know, regular people again. We don't know. This is all speculation. But I think that could be pretty cool. I would love a Naga. Naga was actually number six on my list. I just it barely didn't make the cut to War of the Ancients. And I think that's partly just because I just read War of the Ancients, the trilogy. So <laughs> I think that may have a part into it. But no, guys. Uh, I really think that the Naga uh, could be a big part to play in this. That would be really cool. I don't think they would get their own tribe. But I do think they could get their own... Uh, I do think they could be a, have a really big impact, kind of like Kobolds did on the and the Kobolds and Catalan section. They didn't get their own tribe, but they did make a big impact on the game. So that is theory number one. I think that it could be a Naga expansion. So theory number two, it's not an expansion. Well, not directly. So my theory is is that maybe this isn't a maybe it's a new game mode or a new. 
and just a new expansion, or maybe it's an announcement for both. And I'll tell you guys why I think this. I know I've said in the past that I actually don't think it's that. So, if I just turn this display right here, if we look in the description, they have started the premiere for the showcase of it, alright? And this is what it says here, alright? Join us as Brian Kibler kicks off our massive reveal showcase stream with Hearthstone Game Director ben, ben Lee. So, this right here, just starting with that first sentence, that screams out expansion, alright? So this that's what this is. This is going to be an expansion, alright? But, if we go there, look at this. From there, we'll dive deeper into our plans with the game designers with Chad Nervig and Dean Ayala. I'm sorry if I mispronounce anyone's names. We're going to share more than we ever have before, so tune in and be the first to know what's coming to the tavern in 2020 and beyond. So, that is unique because they usually don't bring in too many developers when going into this. Now, this could just be a major update for Battlegrounds, which is probably what this is, but it's possible this could be a new game mode. Now, that is very unlikely a new game mode because Battlegrounds is still in their beta, guys. They're probably not going to do anything too crazy with that. So, I believe this is going to, this could, my second theory is, is that this could be a new Battlegrounds update too. So, a possible Battlegrounds expansion. Because, to be honest, Battlegrounds is really fun. It's got a lot of cool things to it. But Battlegrounds is something that needs to change a lot to keep people interested. Because you can't add too many minions, because then it creates a problem where if you don't have enough minions, then... If you have too many minions, then it's harder to get the good ones. If you have too many heroes, it's harder to do... You have less of a pool to grab from. And so that is the problem when you, fa you face when you do Battlegrounds. So, keeping expansions for free, and needs to be free, to make this work, I think could be really cool. So, maybe this is some weird theme for Battlegrounds. We don't know. Most likely this is for the Hearthstone, but I thought it was kind of interesting to think about, maybe. Because after reading that, that started to make me think a little bit. So, so there you go, guys. I hope you had a good day, and having a great one. Uh, when the, I'll make a video, of course, as soon as I can, as soon as the Hearthstone announcement has been made. I'll try to do it as fast as possible. I do work that day, but hopefully I can get something out for y'all, and we can talk about it a little bit. So, there you go, guys. Have a great day. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!